Hi guys, it's Saturday, June 11th. Um, I had gotten a couple messages regarding the message that I put up yesterday that we can't be snatched from God's hand. Um, you know, I don't know. Um, all I've seen as far as the once saved, always saved uh, doctrine is that it causes division. And um, I did get a few messages about it privately. And I always, you know, I know what I believe. Um, and I think I know what I believe until I start doubting and questioning because then people come at me with all sorts of different ideas. And I went into prayer over it. And this is the message that I got. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and... Um, read this to you guys. I received this this morning. My daughter, write my words for those with ears to hear. Every heart perceives and receives me differently. My relationship is different with each person on your earth. Perhaps one person had a wonderful relationship with their earthly father, while another person grew up fatherless. These two individuals will see me differently. These different relationships cause different beliefs about me to form. If one person believes one way and another person believes another, it's human nature for each to try to prove their way to be the correct way. I ask this of all my children. Realize that you will never agree on all things. Realize that each child of mine relies on a different path, set of past experiences and different levels of knowledge to base their personal beliefs on. Some people's beliefs may not be the same as yours. What should my children do when they disagree? My children, unless this is a disagreement over who I am and my plan of salvation, love one another. I created man. Man fell in the garden and at that moment was corrupt. I shed my blood on the cross as a sacrifice for the sin of mankind and rose three days later after completely defeating the enemy in hell. My battle is finished. Victory is mine. Whether or not a person receives me into their heart is what matters. My Holy Spirit being received into the hearts of my children is what matters. Most of what I see my children arguing over are matters of man-made doctrine. Every one of my children will come to me over a different time frame, a different way, and on different paths that arrive at the same kingdom address. Each child of mine will face a different set of circumstances that will be used to create in each heart a heart after my very own. Children, in some cases, you must agree to disagree on matters that do not affect your final destination. Always be gracious to your brothers and sisters as you will run across those who are firm in their beliefs. Be gracious, my children. Do not let the enemy drive a wedge between you when you don't understand things the same way. My salvation message is so simple that most anyone can understand it. As your world continues to spiral into darkness, my salvation message will soon become the only thing that matters. For now, love one another. Extend the olive branch to anyone who has offended you. Tear down the walls of discord and unite as my church. You will have different beliefs and understandings of my word and what it means and how my end time plan will carry out. Do not let these differences in opinion keep you apart. Come together now, my children, for your force will be strongest as a united force. United in love, forgive one another, love one another. My Holy Spirit within you is the ultimate teacher. Do not rely on your own understanding always rely on his okay guys have a great day thanks for listening